Okay, man. I was expecting that we will start a new lesson today, but you was as you were saying that we haven't uh, completed this reading of this. So we'll continue with deforestation and overhunting, if I'm not wrong, right? We have studied till impacts of human beings on biodiversity. Today we are going to read out deforestation and overhunting. G. Rafa, is that so? Yes, ma'am. Okay, Zainu Labarin, please start reading of this deforestation and overhunting. Deforestation means what? 3.6 points. Deforestation means cutting down of trees for the uh, conversion of a forest to non forest land. The destruction of significant areas of forest has resulted in a degraded environment with reduced biodiversity causes mm -hmm. and effects of deforestation. Sometimes there is slow forest degradation and sometimes sudden and catastrophic catastrophic um, catas catastrophic clear cutting for urban development. Deforestation can be the result of deliberate removal deliberate. of deliberate removal of forest for wood agriculture of urban development. Deforestation mm. affects the amount of water in soil and moisture in atmosphere. When there are no trees to keep soil in place, there are some chances of soil erosion. Have there are more chances. There are more chances of soil erosion. Heavy rainfall mm. washes soil into rivers. Essential nutrition and uh, are, washed, are washed out of soil. Rivers become choked up, um, with mud and silt, which can cause floods. The silted water gets stored in dams and reduces their water storage capacity. Deforestation right. also contributes to decreases and decreased transpiration, which lessens a cloud formation. This ultimately reduces the source of rains. Sources of rains. Right. Now, basically, here they are discussing about the causes and effects of deforestation. Deforestation is a process in which we cut down the trees in order for urban development. Now, urban development, it means in order to enhance a business or maybe in order to develop a city, in order to develop a village. When we cut out the natural environment of that place, that means deforestation. Now, when this cutting down of the natural environment, this degrades the natural environment, this degrades the forest. This is a catastrophic event for the uh, species which are living in the forests or which are living in the grasslands at that time. Catastrophic kisli kisli hasse catastrophe kate tabakun kisam ke kisi event. Jo tabak at the cheese. Up definitely when you are going to do an uh, urban development on an area and if you are going to wipe out the forest or grasslands from that specific land so wahan pe jo bhi species reh rahi hongi to aap jab uska habitat hi wipe out kar denge theek hai ab habitat kya hai habitat is the place where the species living 
which is providing the shelter to the species which is providing the food to the species which is providing the water to the species jab aap uska wo khatam kar denge habitat aap uska ghar khatam kar denge aap uska home khatam kar denge then wo species kahan jayegi theek hai aur uske baad then we are not stopping by on a specific area hum ek specific area pe stop nahi kar rahe hain theek hai we are continuously developing Are, because we need development. Development करने के लिए हमें न्यू लैंड चाहिए अब डेफिनेटली उन लैंड के ऊपर ऑलरेडी कुछ ना कुछ तो एग्जिस्ट कर रहा होगा तो पहले हमें वो खत्म करना पड़ेगा ये नहीं हम कर सकते कि उसके ऊपर वैसे ही हम कोई बिल्डिंग बना दें तो we need uh, because उसके ऊपर उसकी पूरी construction होनी है तो डेफिनेटली उसको उन्हें वाइप आउट करना पड़ेगा दैट्स वाई इट हैज मैनी ड्रास्टिक इम्पैक्ट ऑन द स्पीशीज विच आर लिविंग एट इन दैट स्पेसिफिक अब वो स्पीशीज इंसेक्ट्स भी हो सकते हैं वो स्पीशीज जो है वो वहां के कोई ये रोडेंट्स भी हो सकते हैं वो स्पीशीज वहां के हर्बी वोर्स भी हो सकते हैं कार्नी बोर्ड भी हो सकते हैं बट जो भी स्पीशी होगी जब आप उसके हैबिटेट को खत्म कर देंगे तो फिर डेफिनेटली उसका सर्वाइवल जो है वो मुश्किल हो जाएगा इवेंचुअली वो स्पीशी जो है वो फिर एक्सटेंशन की तरफ चली जाती है ना उसके लिए वो मल्टीपल रीजन फिर आगे दे रहे हैं कि डिफॉरेस्ट्रेशन के रिजल्ट में क्या होता है सॉइल इरोजन होती है एक तो ठीक है सॉइल इरोजन होती है क्यों क्योंकि ट्रीज की जो रूट्स हैं दे एंकर द सॉइल इन प्लेस एंड जब ट्रीज की रूट्स नहीं होती तो वो सॉइल को एंकर नहीं करते दैट्स व्हाई मोर सॉइल इज वॉश अवे ड्यू टू व्हेन द रेनफॉल कम्स अलोंग हैवी रेनफॉल इट वॉशेस द असेंशियल न्यूट्रिएंट्स आउट ऑफ द सॉइल ठीक है क्योंकि असेंशियल न्यूट्रिय की जो लेयर है वो सबसे टॉप पे है सॉइल अंदर जमीन के असेंशियल न्यूट्रिएंट्स नहीं है इतने तो जब सॉइल की सॉइल इरोजन होगी और उसकी एक्सटर्नल लेयर वाइप आउट होगी तो उसके रिजल्ट में उसके असेंशियल न्यूट्रिएंट्स भी कम हो जाएंगे फिर उसी इरोजन के रिजल्ट में वो जो मट्टी है वो जाएगी नालों में वो जाएगी रिवर्स में रिवर्स के अंदर ज्यादा मड और सेल्ट भरेगा जिसकी वजह से रिवर्स चोक हो जाएंगे वहां ज्यादा फ्लड जाएंगे ठीक है और वो इट्स पॉसिबल कि वो जो वाटर है वो डैम्स के अंदर भी जाए एंड उसकी वाटर स्टोरेज कैपेसिटी को रिड्यूस करे तो इसके अलावा डिफॉरेस्ट्रेशन आल्सो कंट्रीब्यूट्स कंट्रीब्यूट्स टू द डिक्रीज ट्रांसपेरेशन जाहिर इसी बात है ट्रांसपेरेशन इट्स अ प्रोसेस जिसमें प्लांट्स जो हैं दे वेपर दे एमिट वाटर पेपर्स इन द फॉर्म दे एमिट वाटर इन द फॉर्म ऑफ वाटर पेपर्स तो व्हेन दे विल बी नो प्लांट्स दे विल बी नो ट्रांसपेरेशन डेफिनेटली एंड दिस इज गोइंग टू लेसन द क्लाउड फॉर्मेशन क्योंकि ये ट्रांसपेरेशन बेसिकली वाटर पेपर्स होते हैं ये वाटर पेपर्स ऊपर एटमोसफेयर में जाते हैं एटमोसफेयर में जाके क्लाउड फॉर्म क्लाउड फॉर्म करते हैं जिसकी वजह से फिर रेनफॉल होती है तो इफ वी आर कटिंग डाउन द ट्रीज वी आर एक्चुअली रिड्यूसिंग द सोर्सेस ऑफ रेन टू ठीक है नाउ एज यू कैन सी दिस इज दे आर शोइंग टाइप ऑफ एन इरोडेड सॉइल ओवर हेयर यहाँ पे ये रोडेड सॉइल की एग्जांपल दे रहे एंड यहाँ पे करेड फॉरेस्ट की एग्जांपल दे रहे right. जी राफे प्लीज रीड यस मैम फॉरेस्ट कंसिडर एबल बायोडिवर्सिटी दूनिट Utilization of forest products, including timber and fuel, would have played a key role in human society. Today, he developed countries continue to utilize timber 
for building a seven wood pulp for making paper. The voice predicts in the future. Large part of the economy in the wallop and developing countries, short term economic growth, main bank conservation, but of five to agriculture of leaves, the loss of long term income. Four of extra carbon dioxide and pollutants from the earth have contributed to biosphere stability. Forest have also valued for their aesthetic beauty and tourist attraction. Right. These important aspects of forest are also harmed due to deforestation. In Pakistan, due to deforestation is a great threat to, to biodiversity. In the province, Khyber Pakhtukhwa, the deforest in the province Khyber Pakhtukhwa, the closed canary forest are shrinking at approximately one percent per year. Overheading, overheading right. is so basically. A... Sorry, I'm interrupting. Basically, this is how much the forest we are consuming per year. Now, its consumption it is happening because of many reasons. Because we are using medicines out of them, we are using wood pulp, wood pulp. We are using its timber to build house, houses and furniture. And short term economic gains के लिए हम deforestation करते हैं, ठीक है? Okay, G. Overhunting. Keep reading, Rafi. Yes, ma'am. Overhunting has been a significant cause of the extinction of hundreds of species and the endangerment of many more, such as whales, ibex, ruler. Marhu, the national animal of Pakistan, etc. Commercial hunting, both legal and illegal, is the principal threat. Hmm. So basically, what is over hunting? What do they mean by over hunting? Remember, over hunting it means that the it. We kill a hundred of species, right? By hunting them down. By hunting them down. Yeah, and the, due to that, the this is uh, a significant cause of extinction of these species. बहुत सारी species इस वजह से extinct हो रही हैं because they are being overhunted. Because उनकी overhunting हो रही है. Okay, it's a threat to biodiversity among the and it's among the hot topics which are discussed in the UN World Summit. Okay, steps for the conservation of biodiversity. Yes. G. Please read. Conservation of biodiversity has become a global concern. By all this, as the national policy makers to state a set of rules, rules necessary to protect a species, the demand that the demand that laws should define species which are threatened by extinction and must be protected. To reach in biodiversity, Pakistan today faces several threats to its animal and plant species. The greatest concern is the loss of natural habitats, which are in causes of death loss, uh, rapid growth in human population, and the prevailing poverty in rural areas of Pakistan. In addition, low literacy rate is also a reason for the failure conservation of measures uh, taken so far by the International Union for the Conservation of Nature and Natural Resources (IUCN) and the World Wildlife Fund (Pakistan WWFP). Work in close mm-hmm. coordination with Pakistan's Ministry of Environment and other government and non-government institutions. The IUCN have prepared uh, the first national red list list of endangered or threatened species. Following are a few examples of environmental work that have been carried out in Pakistan in order to conserve species and have and has created habitats. National conservation okay. strategy. So basically, uh, 
they in over here they are take, uh, telling you that the there are some steps which are which the government is taking in order to conserve biodiversity and the main um, you can say it's a global concern and the main uh, organizations which are working for the this purpose for conservation of biodiversity conservation ka matlab hai biodiversity ko save karna theek hai to do jo do main organizations hain which are working for the conservation of biodiversity they are the national union for the conservation of nature and natural resources that is iucn and the world wildlife fund pakistan pakistan mein ye do organizations they are working in coordination with pakistan ministry of environment and other uh, ngos ngos ke sath ye aur kaam kar rahi hai in order to uh, basically conserve biodiversity ab ye basically uh, jo conservation ho rahi hai biodiversity ki that is happening as they have made some some rules some regulations they have implemented certain laws that over hunting nahi karni and this and that cutting they should not people should not cut down trees from certain areas jahan pe wo rahe hain and uh, plus additionally uh, they have prepared a red list now a red list is a list of endangered or threatened species endangered species wo hoti hain jo which are close to extinction theek hai thode se baad wo extinct hone wali ho ya extinct ho jaye wo endangered species hoti hain threatened species wo hoti hain jo endangered hone wali ho jo endangered ke ki borderline ke upar ho उन्हें थ्रेटन कहते हैं और जो एक्सटिंक्शन की के करीब हो उन्हें एंडेंजर्ड कहते हैं बेसिकली मींस दे आर इन द डेंजर जोन ऑफ बीइंग एक्सटिंक नाउ द फॉलोइंग आर फ्यू एग्जांपल्स ऑफ एनवायरमेंटल वर्क दैट हैज बीन कैरीड आउट इन पाकिस्तान इन ऑर्डर टू कंजर्व द स्पीशीज एंड एसोसिएटेड हैबिटेट्स सो दीस आर द वर्क्स जी uh then please read na sabse pehle hamare paas hai national conservation strategy this was implemented in 1980s by iucn and government of pakistan and form they formulated this strategy for conservation of biodiversity in 1980s IUCN and government of Pakistan चीजें आपको याद होनी चाहिए इसके बाद में अगेन एक ट्रीटी आई फॉर ड्राई लैंड ड्राई लैंड कौन से होते हैं टेरेस्ट्रियल लैंड आर नोन एज ड्राई लैंड ठीक है जमीने जो नॉर्मल होती हैं जिनके ऊपर दरख्त नहीं होते नाउ यूएन कन्वेंशन ऑन कम्बैटिंग डिजर्टिफिकेशन ठीक है मतलब ऐसी बंजर जमीन जिसको कहते हैं मतलब जहां पे कुछ ग्रो नहीं कर सकता उसको रिकवर करने का ये आ, मतलब ट्रीटी थी 1997 में दे साइंड दिस ट्रीटी देन हिमालयन जंगल प्रोजेक्ट ये स्पेसिफिकली आगे फिर ये स्पेसिफाई होते जाएंगे एरियाज के अकॉर्डिंगली हिमालयन जंगल प्रोजेक्ट जो है वो 1991 में स्पेसिफिकली पलास वैली के अंदर इम्प्लीमेंट uh, किया गया था बाई इन खैबर पखूनवा के पी के बिकॉज वहां की बायोडाइवर्सिटी दैट वॉज इन थ्रेटन देन कंजर्वेशन ऑफ बायोडाइवर्सिटी ऑफ सलेमान रेंज दिस वॉज अगेन कंजर्वेशन स्ट्रेटजी फॉर 
specifically the Chilgoza forest of Suleiman range in 1992. Then the Northern Areas Conservation Project, which can the Sare Northern Areas ko in the cover kiya WWFP ne, which may in the isko unhe preserve karne ki koshish kiya. Okay, then conservation of migratory birds in Chitral. Okay, specifically Chitral. In 1992, hunting pressure was very much in Chitral. I mean, before that, hunt was done by specific type of birds in Chitral. So, uh, they, the people, they, uh, the, these people, basically IUCN or WWF Pakistan they initiated this project Hello. Boys, can you hear me? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Ch conservation of Sultan Markor was again a specific locality in Hazar Ganji National Park, which is close to Quetta, where the habitat of Sultan Markor was conserved. Then, ban kiye gay games ke upar. ठीक है कि गेम्स नहीं की जा सकती हैं कि राइट Can you see my screen? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Then endangered species in Pakistan. These are some of the endangered species in Pakistan. Please read them out of it. Endangered species in Pakistan. Due to human activity of the biodiversity in Pakistan, it is facing a great loss. Here are a few examples of endangered species in Pakistan. End of dolphin. According to WWFP, only 600 animals of the species of Indus dolphin left today in the Indus River. The population of the species declined due to water pollution, poaching, and destruction of habitat. Hmm. Marco Polo sheep. Marco Polo sheep are mostly found in Khunjab National Park and nearby and nearby areas. Their numbers have been rapidly decreasing in the last two decades and WWFP have started projects for its conversion. Hubara Buster. The bird flies to Pakistan in winter season from summer Soviet territory and settles in Chalistan and third the average. The decline in its population is due to hunting by foreigners and destruction of its habitat. Right. Okay, so these are some of the species which are endangered in Pakistan right now. Vesto, these are not the only which are endangered. Iske lava, tiger, cheetah, these are also some species which are both endangered hai at this moment of time. Agar aap ko bhi red list dekhe to, you will get to know that. So, G, is it clear? Yes, ma'am. Koi question to nahi hai, boys. You are supposed to do all its question answers on your notebooks. Jitne reh gaye hain.
अंडरस्टैंडिंग द कॉन्सेप्ट आप लोगों ने ऑलमोस्ट सारे कर लिए थे आई थिंक आई गेव यू शॉर्ट क्वेश्चन नहीं किए थे शॉर्ट क्वेश्चन को कर लें ठीक है क्वेश्चन वो वन टू फाइव शॉर्ट क्वेश्चन ओके एनी अदर क्वेश्चन ओके बॉयज ये क्वेश्चन आप कर लीजिएगा एंड शेयर दम the assignment with me uh, and inshallah i'll see you in the next class allah okay hafiz. ma'am okay allah hafiz allah hafiz